There are over 250 species of bee in the UK, but new research shows that a third of pollinating insects like the bee are in decline. Here in York, one eco-primary school has come up with a unique way of teaching the pupils why we should keep the buzz of the bees alive for years to come. Um, actually beekeeping because we wanted to really let the children and the parents and the rest of the country really know how important bees are to our own existence. Uh, we've been doing this for three years. I've trained everybody in year six, five and four now and then it will hopefully continue. Um, and we've been keeping bees in our apiary. We've got two colonies at the moment to do work which is cross-curricular. It goes into all other lessons, maths, art, music, bee dancers, etc. So it's generally we are the forerunners uh, in, in the north. Um, not many schools have got bees. With around 70,000 bees now calling Topwith Primary Academy home, how do they go about looking after them? When you're beekeeping, you need a smoker, which is where it's a box and a tool, and you set a light to it, and then you press a pump, which um, send smoke into the beehive. The bees then think it's a forest fire. It makes them calmer and less yeah, aggressive. Have a... so you have to be quite quiet. Don't flail your arms. Don't make a big deal of anything because then they'll just get even more angry at you. Don't move the hive because as soon as you move it, the bees won't know how to get in and then they'll die. According to research conducted by Parliament UK, pollinators like the bee are estimated to increase the value of crops, yield and quality by up to £600 million per year in the UK. Well, we got the bees to help the environment and we also, when we get the honey out of the frames, we then collect it and we sell it to the summer fair that we have. Well, bees are important because they pollinate the flowers and plants to keep them alive. And with plants and trees, you can also give oxygen to keep you alive in general. So then it all, it all like links up. A number of factors have led to the decline in pollinators since the 1980s. Neonicotinoid is um, this poison that was set out by farmers and it started killing bees but it's slowly, um, it's like, it's not really happening anymore. And hornets, they, they're an invasive, well Asian hornets, an invasive species and um, they are coming to um, the England and they're hurting bees and destroying their nests so we have to look at look after the bees and make sure they don't get attacked by Asian hornets. And the bees seem to be giving back to the pupils in more ways than one. What we do with the honey is um, once we sold them, well we sell them at the um, summer fair, and then we go and buy more equipment for the bees like brand new beehives um, and more jars so we can sell more. Um, and we love um, recycling the jars. It's hoped that through understanding the importance of the bee and experiencing how to be a beekeeper firsthand, that these pupils will have the knowledge and the understanding to pave the way in saving the UK's pollinators for generations to come. Abby Walker, That's TV.